Thanks, guys. Have a good day. Bye. All right, you guys. I've got it. Fresh off the grill here from Doghouse in Denver, the Pig Lebowski. We're going to check it out. I'm going to find my car. We're going to find a spot. I'm going to park it, and we're going to check it out. Welcome back, everybody, to an all-new Fast Food Pit Stops. I'm your host, Justin. I'm here for the first time at Dog House Gourmet Hot Dogs and Hamburgers to check out something really cool. We're talking about the Pig Lebowski. That's with a P, not a B. But let's focus on the hot dog here, or should I say gourmet sausage. There is a difference. See, Dog House does it different. First of all, they start out with a ton of different varieties of gourmet sausages that you can choose from. You know, it's nitrite-free, nitrate-free, GMO-free, fair trade, organic, shade-grown, picked by an Aborigine, but this is it. Now they have a lot of different types of variations, fun names of sandwiches. You can do like hot dogs, gourmet sausages, burgers. I got the pig. The Pig Lebowski, or maybe they just thought I was really fat. I want you guys just to look at this before I even talk about what's on it. You ready? I know. I was surprised too. French fries, coleslaw, with a Polish kielbasa sausage, topped off with a drizzle of barbecue sauce, all on Hawaiian sweet rolls to make up the bun. It's gonna be a big bite. It's gonna be epically, proportionately, super messy, super fire. The Pig Lebowski from Dog House. The price was $8 with tax out the door. And that's pretty much the going rate for their gourmet sausages. You could go the cheaper route and just get one of their regular hot dogs. They're about $5.50. And of course they have a really amazing looking selection of hamburgers, which you know I'm gonna have to come back and try. Slaw is just coming off. Looks like seasoned French fries. See the Hawaiian bread rolls. It looks like they've taken like maybe three of them, split them in half, buttered them up, grilled them on the flat top to sort of make that nice, buttery, crispy, trademark looking bun that Doghouse is known for. And again, this is a Polish kibalsa sausage. Looks like there's coleslaw on top, French fries, barbecue sauce. It's just the way it comes. Enough talking, let's do it here. A first bite, big bite. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> well, what I didn't catch in my mouth clearly landed in my breast area. Now, if you're going into this thinking that you're not going to need a fork, don't make the same mistake that I did, because right now all I have are my phalanges to grab, but it's going to be messy, but it tastes really pretty good. <laughs> There's the inside of their Polish kibalska or kibalsa gourmet sausage i can definitely detect the absence of nitrites and nitrates the sausage though is pretty good it's finished off well you guys saw how like their sausages are kind of lined up it looks like they're cooked from a raw state which is nice you're getting a fresh juicy moist tender piece of meat and they have all sorts of wacky creations and toppings to make signature sandwiches and dogs See if we can get another big bite. Mm. Yeah, the barbecue sauce on this is nice and sweet. The coleslaw is like a mayonnaise base, so it's very creamy. The french fries kind of add a seasoned crunch. The Hawaiian sweet rolls are just, well, they're Hawaiian sweet rolls. Who can complain about that? The hot dog has a nice little kick some spices and seasonings. Overall, it's a pretty good flavor appeal. Pause the screen, take a look. They've got all sorts of different varieties. And even on the back, they've got like little sliders, 
sides, all sorts of good looking stuff. Doghouse. You know, I think on a scale of one to 10 here for the Pig Lebowski with the Polish kielbasa, the French fries, the doghouse slaw, and the barbecue sauce on top, sandwiched and nestled and bunned in between some King's Hawaiian rolls. What a mix for $8, a huge gourmet hot dog. It's like a six and a half or a seven. It's a really good taste. I know I made it seem like it was gonna be absolutely fantastic, a 10 for the win. However, there's so much more available on the menu. If I just thought this was the best thing since sliced Hawaiian bread, this is all I would get. I bet you they've got something hiding in their cellar that'll be even better. So you guys are gonna have to stay tuned. As for this doghouse Pig Lebowski, I think I'm gonna do it here. A last bite, big bite, like half of a dog sized bite of the Pig Lebowski here from Doghouse. But as always, thanks again everybody for checking out another great review here on Fast Food Pit Stops. I'm your host, Justin. You know you love it. You came back for some more, but I'll be back for another fast food review. Cheers. Big bite. <laughs>